In this video, we find even more epic old vintage lifts. So now to the first one, which is an epic 1950s Evans lift. This lift is completely original apart from the logic, which has sadly been replaced. Well, the first building I come in and... Well, what do you know? This place is epic. This an Evans lift. I was expecting it. It's literally the first building I go in. It's got one of these. Please be original. I felt like it's on a VF drive. Nine hundred LBs. That is a classic. Oh, it's on VF. Oh, on slates. I don't want VFs. Now we go to the next lift which is a vintage 100% original 1930s to 1960s Marriott Scott lift. This lift is completely, utterly epic, so let's ride it. Round floor. And let's surf it. And now I go along to an epic 1960s express lift. This lift is completely original apart from the inspection truck. Call it! And let's surf it! And let's go up to the motor room. And now we go to a seaside tower block. This building has some completely awesome 1960s Otis lifts. These lifts are completely original apart from that the inside buttons have been replaced. They've still got original logic and have the very rare DC version of the old Otis logic. Look how beefy that is. That has to be for the original. Hold your job. 
Let's now surf these epic lifts and just notice how fast these lifts do accelerate. They make your stomach turn and slow down so quick. And now we go to an absolutely epic 1930s express lift. This lift, I believe, is 100% original. Although the logic may have been replaced with an equivalent reload logic, or it might be original, I don't know. Nice if the door open. And now I go to another completely awesome 1930s express lift. Oh, it's got a seat. That's just slightly different to the others. This is an express. 
And now we go along to a completely awesome 1930s Marriott Scott lift. Yes, that's right, it's a Marriott Scott. Oh, that is nice, that's classic. This lift is 100% original. Nothing about this lift has been altered from when it was installed in the 30s. Number four. Motor sounds very nice. Mm -hmm. That is classic. Best lift. And now I go along to an epic 1950s pickerings with some lift buttons that I've never seen before. Sadly though, it wasn't working. No, oh, it's a vintage pickerings. I've never seen this model. Basement. basement. Oh, the lift's not going to basement. Oh, wow. it's got pickering ceiling. Vintage pickering ceiling. Pickering ceiling. It's a classic pickering ceiling. You've got these version of buttons. I've not seen these buttons. This is some really up pickering buttons. So let's go in and see if we can get this to work. This isn't working for someone who isn't. Pickerings, how could you let me down? Pickerings. Oh, oh, it's very vintage anyway. Have a look how vintage it is, even though it sadly doesn't work. Look at that classic pickering ceiling. Look how those walls. I've not seen one quite like that before. Look at that lever. That's so interesting. And now I go along to a 1930s Barrett Scott, which has sadly been a bit modernised. This thing has the updated digital advanced version of the message. Please close the door. The original message was in the digital lift controls voice. The digital advanced version goes, please close inner and outer doors. Which version of this message do you prefer? Please close inner and outer doors. Close inner and the doors. Please close inner and the doors. Sounds like. Please close inner and outer doors. That's weird that is. What's that the updated one? It was please close the door. Now it's please close inner and outer doors. Now we go along to some very awesome 1930s top of the range Otis lifts. These lifts were very advanced for the time with automatic doors, levelling and when there's a group of two of these they even work as a set. This was advanced for the 30s. Sadly both these lifts have now had their logic replaced but they still run very originally. Hi, Abby. Let's surf it. Door on that one. This one's more original. This one. Oh. That is nice. Oh, that's, that's actually slightly nicer than the other one. Yeah. There's windows in the shaft. That's so nice. I love that this has got a visual door. says way good Otis oil something and now I go along to a 1960s express lift which is 100% original express. express yeah that's original definitely that is original that's 100% original that's that's very good go floor below go floor below and I'll shut up oh yes and the last floor lift express and it's got a weird caged shaft or something. Yeah, it's probably, it's probably replaced it. The caged shaft. I didn't realise. Oh. 
done. Bye bye Express. I look at cards off, that's very interesting. And now I've got a long to a very epic 1930s Evans lift. Sadly, the logic in this lift has been replaced. Oh, what did? And now we go along to Marriott Scotland. These buildings have loads of original Marriott Scots. First into one of the passenger lifts. This one has sadly had its logic replaced. The secret tunnel between the two buildings. There's a new logic in this one. The yeah, other one's better because the logic's original. A lift car's untouched. <coughs> uh, it's out of been modernised. Yeah, it's one's in the Yeah, it's Our basement. Spooky tunnel between Marriott Scotland 1 and Marriott Scotland 2. Which lift shall we take? Marriott Scott, completely original apart from the logic supplied, or Trades Lift Marriott Scott, which is 100% original? I think we'll choose yeah, the Trades Lift. And along to one of the service lifts, which is 100% original. This is safety bypass time. I yes, think it is. Running with the doors open. That's how we like it, isn't it? That's the best way to run a lift. How else do you run a lift? Oh, with the door bypass, of course. And now we go along to an awesome 1950s Evans lift, which was sadly not working. That is what you call an absolute classic. What the fuck's happened to this? Evans, that's nice. Let's see how it works. We're amazed if this works. Yeah. Oh, it's got, it's in a door list, like a Pickerings. No, oh look, it's got a classic, it's got a weird like little circle in the middle of a button. It's an absolute classic, it's a 50s model, is this the earlier model? Oh, Evans, how can you let me down? Come on, go Evans. Oh, it's such a shame, it's so epic. Down floor. Go, first floor. <laughs> Now we got along to a 1930s Janey Hall lift. And this lift goes very fast for a 1930s lift. Janey Hall. And now go along to a 1960s Pickerings. Sadly, the logic's been replaced, but surprisingly, this lift still there, doesn't like. have inner doors. <laughs> Mr. Pickerings, what's happened to you, Mr. Pickerings? Don't leave Pickerings for that bit there, but. Mr. Pickerings, I still want a door list. Is it a door list still? Oh. The Pickering ceiling, classic. Leicester. 
Didn't expect that on a mod, but I didn't have the inner door. Why did you touch the shaft? The lift stops. Another long suit, a 1960s Keefe lift. 60s Keefe lifts are very rare, but sadly this one's had its logic replaced. <laughs> It's been Leicesterized. Fucking Leicester. Keith Lee. There. Seen the shaft there. Imagine if he could get through the secret floor to it. The entry in the code up here. So get to the secret floor, you go 3434 four, round 112. It's going to secret floor now. Maybe not. And now along to a 1950s Otis lift. This lift is 100% original. Otis, a gas mask. Oh, it's not, I haven't seen one like this for a long time. This has got them, this looks a bit old for them. So nice, I suppose. It's an LBS. 